Right. He loves it. Yeah. Game number one going to see, see the zombie. Zombie, okay. as opposed to the uh, Alex. You know. yeah, he loves Definitely that. some uh, nice cold comfort there for Paulo. A now, little bit different of a matchup. Most of the time, Antimony is a lot faster paced than Just Blue. Sure. Mm -hmm. He likes going slower or going faster, but right. he does get a lot more materials usually. Yes. Okay. Because he uses this downtime just to mine, but he doesn't have a lot of it. Also, he'll go for that setup a lot, which is oh, yep. basically don't get grabbed here, you die at like. Yeah, the Cory block, as right. uh, we call it in Boston. <laughs> yeah, he does that a lot. It is a fantastic tool, especially just to kind of get some corner pressure off of you to let them, you know, leave you alone. Sure. Just for the, the threat of who knows what. <laughs> yeah, especially. We all know what. Yeah, we yeah. all know what's going to happen, but especially with not even going for the grab setup, just keep mining. They can't really approach you because you could just grab right. and kill yeah. them. Oh, oh, what a reflector again. All right. Interesting. Now, Antimony, you just saw that happen. That <laughs> just blew. I was just going to say, like, <laughs> don't let it be you the second time. Like, you already have the data. Yeah, That's I the benefit of going second in these situations. Yeah. Like, you know yeah. the tricks. But Paulo, like, a lot of new tools and new approaches to the matchup that we didn't really see in the last set. Sure. I don't know if it's just Antimony's different pace or if Paulo learned some new tricks. He might have just needed some time. Yeah. You know? Honestly, he was, he was learning stuff versus Just Blue. So, I like, at the end of that set, it was very close. The last two games. And especially with how Antimony plays differently, he's a lot faster paced. It could help against uh, a character like Fox. Mm -hmm. Sure. Mm -hmm. A good mine card to force the jump right there. A little bit of a trade to set up the edge guard. Oh, down there. Smart. Oh, gets the sour spot on the footstool there. <laughs> Didn't get the sweet spot. That's going to be killing. He's up three that sets to one. That was forward air four into up smash. <laughs> that was crazy. <laughs> what? All right. Can't reflect them all. It turns out, but <laughs> still trying to respond, getting around this wall pretty handily. Yep. Only gets one. Got to be very careful. Again, even if you're up two stocks, you could lose a stock at zero right. from uh, that from oh, that movie. Might yeah. happen right here. Let's see. Yeah, yeah well, uh, too. Yep. <laughs> I was about to complain because we've talked about it way more than it has happened. Uh, Just Blue <laughs> not really following through on the you know crazy hit. But Prophecy. Yeah. Antimony's a lot of crazy hits already. Evens it up. Takes the lead, in fact. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And was like, oh, you guys want to parry into death at a 4%? All right, I got you. Yeah. Got you. <laughs> now he's brought up completely back to even, just how this character works. But he will can't get forward tilted again, and with Fox neutral. <laughs> yeah, he can't die from zero again, guys, only right. once. <laughs> That's true. Can't die to zero. Ooh. Oh, wow, down tilt. Wow, tilted. that killed. Paulo heard me, you know, talking a little smack. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Light would have hit steel dash tech back here. Paulo said, I got yeah. down tilt back here. Yeah, I'm crazier. Good stuff. <laughs> and what a pickup, and what a... Huge change of pace. Yeah, from uh, that last okay. set. Not not what we would have expected. Uh, you know, coming from that last set, you get three yeah. owed by uh, Just Blue. Mm -hmm. Got Antimony generally accepted to be the uh, superior Steve by a little bit. I was really and I uh, just kind of beat him up that game number one. I was really expecting the um, that back air on Fox not to kill because that's one the meme, but two, I it was like the second time it hit. Right. So I thought yeah. it would be stale. Mm -hmm. No, I don't, maybe. I don't think it was the case, but there is a possibility of holding out for the combo DI and then just kind of getting hit yeah, by that back air maybe. unexpectedly. But we're going to uh, uh, the, the new classic counter pick. Yeah, is this where we go in this matchup, oh, I guess? I, okay, I just want to get in these up tilt combos in about 45, 50%. Yeah. Not going to result yeah, in that. Keeping it going. Oh my god, I did not know how he did that. I've seen so many of those just at DTN when I got to commentate the Antimony sets. Mm -hmm. Antimony's like no impact lands and like the block timing to extend with the up smash. So phenomenal, and we saw just a little preview of it at the start of that game. But Paulo answering back. Paulo is answering back. Oh, good down air again. Just kind of poking shield, kind of overwhelming Steve again. This matchup isn't great for Fox, but Fox has the movement. No matter what, yeah, it is possible. It's hundred percent possible. He's got the tools. Mm -hmm. Good dash attack there. Good stuff to cover that landing and the jump from the ledge as well. Antimony playing a little bit more. You know, reserved, more, you know, reactive, and it's yeah. working out so far. Back throw going to set up for a dangerous position. 100%. Again, in this matchup, you can't run at Fox. Fox needs to run at you, and you need to counter with that with a back air. Yeah. Just because of how fast Fox is and how slow and, I guess, not dinky, but, like, kind of no, no jump height, no nothing Steve oh. is. You, you have to let Fox come to you. Right, right. Oh, uh, right oh. now. He's like, watch out. Yeah, yeah watch out. There was, a, there. there was a block, and he was next to the ledge. That's forward tilt central. <laughs> Up throw, trying to punish a landing here, whether it be with the anvil or just, you know, going back down. Either way, good pressure. Oh. 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 Here. Oh. What? I'm terrified. I don't know what happened, but Paul got out of it alive. Yeah. Ooh, staying in the minecart. Very smart. Paul not ready for it. We Probably the first diamond we've seen in a very long time. Oh, yeah. Mostly just because Paolo... Oh, my goodness. Jesus. I was going to say... 
doesn't really give them time to mine, right? Because of yeah. the aggressiveness from Fox. Sure. But now with Diamond, Antimony is going to be a whole other just animal. Right, right. He is probably the best at using Diamonds in this region. He gets it and oh. he just kills you off. Oh, yeah. That. I don't even think this is competition. Yeah. Um, oh. That was a big hit. Not going to hit that down smash. Still putting pressure on with these back airs, but Paulo finds a way in and around. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Got to be careful. Oh, he learned that time. Though. He yeah, learned. he did learn. Yeah, yeah. That can kill at like zero, by the way. I've seen <laughs> him die at like 30 from that reflection. He's going to not get hit by it and keep it going. Okay, Diamond tools, quick 40%, thankfully, but <sighs> Paulo trying to keep it going. Oh, nice little forward air. Yeah, right now, Antimony needs to get another diamond to keep this, mm. his stranglehold in the situation. He needs to keep mining, keep whiff punishing, keep it going. Oh, he's that was so such gross. a good pickup. It was also so gross. <laughs> <laughs> nope. yeah. Many things can be true. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's so tough in that spot. There's a whole, like, once we see that little thing of the diamond, the dynamic shifts drastically, because now Paulo is trying to force the issue because the diamond is just like a rich get richer situation, right? Yes. All yeah. of a sudden you have these crazy combos, you mine faster, you get further down in the queue, you threaten this extra diamond for the next stock. Yeah. Like it's so tough. So I understand yeah. the sense of urgency, but unfortunately Antimony was ready to punish all of those maybe overly aggressive options to yeah. follow. It also something about Fox, he can't a lot of people when Steve is having to start camping harder, Fox can't camp. That's no, that Fox can't yeah. do that. Like, oh you have lasers. Well guess what? He's got block. He's like, blocked in a block laser, it don't matter. How do we feel about the stage? Talos? Um This is a uh, a Fox favorite because it's a light favorite, I think. But yeah. in terms of I like the dynamic that it gives the Steve mining not great. I, think I mean, oh my oh, god, he's dead. Gross. Okay, no. then. Also, especially with just the knockback of how, like, Fox the Fox Baller can't yeah. come back to that. Yeah, but you can see already the dynamic. Look at all of that iron. Yeah. Even after yeah. the minecart, there's just so much iron that you're going to see here because of all this fun little, you know, <laughs> Steve factoids. Mm -hmm. And I feel like we were mentioning, like, the main thing that uh, Fox has over Steve in this matchup is that mobility, right? right. That speed. Mm -hmm. But when. Uh, Steve has this much iron. I feel like that advantage kind of disappears. You've got access to powered minecart basically on demand. Mm -hmm. You can go ooh, wherever you want, kind of. But nice up there. Uh, Apollo, you know, ooh. making sure we know it's not over just yet. Yeah, yeah. I do see the, the choice in picking this. Iron is lot takes longer to mine sure. in general. Yeah. So he's like, well, if I can just, I have more time to get on him, and he gets less materials. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that being said, you do give him a lot more iron, and that can be risky, especially if you die early, like what happened in this game. He got a bunch wow. of iron immediately. Yep. We're going to see a lot more of those, I'm sure. And those were already so fantastic in the last game, so you got to watch out. But Paul is still tacking the damage on. Every you know, small opening is turning into a big lead. Paul's doing a great job overall. I mean, yeah. I think Just Blue was a great warm-up for this because now he's just – it is dead even, even though he, like, died at zero. Right, right. Okay, jumping over the blocks, yeah. but good timing there. It feels like Antimony is trying to, like, get to Fox before Fox gets to him. Mm. And that is kind of hurting him because you saw there he, like, tried to jump and hit Apollo. Yeah. But you can't really do that against Fox. Fox is too unpredictable. You have to wait till he gets to you and hits you. Mm -hmm. Especially exactly. as Steve does get gold now, which will pyre, power his uh, minecart. Okay, uses the last bit of iron though on that anvil, Ooh. but huge time to mine right now already. It's that diamond. And yeah. there's diamonds. Probably oh. use it next stock. What a lineup too. Just a bunch of stone yeah. and a bunch <laughs> of iron. Well, the iron kind of gone, but yeah. yeah. And the gold and diamond. And the gold and diamond back as well. Uh oh. Okay, SDI is away. Very good stuff. Oh, Follow. Yeah, it was stone. Not true there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not going to get killed off of that. Quite. <laughs> but he is still going to get jabbed. Nice. A couple jabs into the forward smash. Not quite a stock, but a good amount of percent. Yeah. Good use of the platform yeah, and great offensive option, too. Keeping the pressure up. Follow, trying to keep it close, but, oh, geez. Quick craft right there, maybe, you know? He's trying to craft, but Paulo's actually doing a great job not letting him craft. See, and again, doesn't have diamonds still, still has it. There it is, finally going to get diamonds. Antimony now has his win condition. Can he use it to win? And now we see the stone coming again, in, too. So yeah. all, <laughs> all the extra block health makes the lasers much worse, and uh, that's got to be it, right? Oh, no. Hello? He misses it. He did okay. not die, though. What Funny he would SD there. Oh. Anvil oh, isn't a kick. Yeah. He actually DI'd that right. I would not have been prepared to uh, DI that the other direction. Right. Right. Yeah. Anvil, but still going to end up losing that stock to it, so... Got to think about uh, game number four here. What character? You just get all you get back from that far, which is up B. Like, <laughs> yeah, it's kind of crazy. It's a little crazy. That's some tech they have. Yeah. It was not supposed to go that I'm far sure. up. It's probably but like they teched yeah. it out. Of course, yeah. they did. there's like ten letter abbreviation for it. You know. <laughs> yeah. But 
really interesting dynamic. I think the stage counter pick had some pros and cons. I mm -hmm. wouldn't be surprised if we ran it back, but I could also right. see a change of pace. I think he want, I think I want platforms because the stages he's lost on were kind of flat mostly, mm -hmm. and the platforms he's got a lot of a lot of damage off of. He got like kills at like eighty or ninety off the top because of the PS2 platforms. Yeah, we do have a confirmed pick. You know, we are going back to Kalos house. here. Nice, nice. Um, I, mean, I feel like the platforms. I know about that one, man. <laughs> yeah. Just we'll so many things are different. We'll see. No, we'll we'll see. see. I want to hear you out. No, no, go, go for oh, it. Yeah, talk, talk to me. I think What's platforms up? are bad because you can build a wall against the platform, mm -hmm. and then you're like, oh, I can land on top of this platform, and right. then you just die. Okay. Do you uh, want to speak on what uh, just happened? <laughs> 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 Turns out you could, if you build walls horizontally. Yeah. Horizontally. Yeah, yeah, they yeah, also yeah. die. Yeah. They call them floors, but you get the floors. <laughs> They're walls on the ground. Who cares? Ooh, okay. okay. This is uh, what a crazy match to get back to. Already 63 it's on that second. What is happening? Oh Dude, coming up on the 30 second mark here. Right. And somebody just came four. in like a bulldozer. Oh. It does not care. Unbelievable. I, I said that thing earlier about you know Fox is a puzzle, like a train coming at you, but it feels yeah. like Antimony is uh, you know Antimony. the conductor right now. <laughs> it feels like yeah. It feels like yeah. he's playing his aggressive play, yeah. but he now has the download to know what Paulo is going to do, and he's punishing him for oh that. That's God. a lot. It's not even been 50 seconds. I finally yeah, 50 this is seconds. Tough. We're coming up on the one minute mark now. Like, damn. Right, right. Imagine you like are in the crowd. You went uh, went to the bathroom. You just just got back. <laughs> yeah. Like, oh wait, what? What happened? Yeah. No way. He traded with the parry. Oh, I like the jumping off the anvil right there. Still pressuring while getting some very little time to mine. And okay. good pick up there. Get up attack. Getting punished. And yep. one of the bravest people in the venue lets out a <laughs> let's go, Paolo. <laughs> good for that guy. Uh, unbelievable. I love the dedication. Which, I mean, hey, if you believe, oh more power than you, Lord. but oh, yeah. he didn't have much. Yeah, he didn't have much to say after that one. And I think they just went to hide. But good stuff. Yeah. <laughs>